hello guys welcome back to chili philly and so today i'm going to show you how to make a sliding animation in the vertical axis and you can see on your screen that when i hover over this area you can see our top content is moving is changing its height height to zero percent okay so i'm going to show you how to make this kind of animation and here i am going to use this uh, html and css file i am not going to use any kind of javascript code for it and here i have the basic skeleton of html and i am giving it the title of sliding you can give it any title whatever you want and i am linking the css file and it is a style sheet so i am writing the style sheet and we have to reference it by its name or its path and its path is sliding animation one dot css okay so in the body body tag inside the body tag i am opening a div tag and giving it the id of container okay so i'm also going to close it and inside the div tag i'm going to open a new new div id yeah a new div tag and give it the id of wrapper okay i'm not going to close it right now and inside this wrapper id wrapper div i'm going to open one more div tag and giving it the id of content Okay, and inside this I am going to open a heading tag and given any text whatever you like okay so now I'm close I'm going to close this data sorry capital letter and now I'm going to open one more div tag and giving it the id of top and i'm going to close it now inside this div tag i'm going to open a heading tag and give it same content which we have given in the id called content okay i will tell you later why we have given this same text here and here okay so now we have to close the div text that we have opened and i am going to close this sorry once again div and this div are taken this also and this div text is also okay there are three opening due tags sorry four opening due tags and three four closing due tags and i'm going to save it and open the css file now in the css file first of all i'm going to write the code for the body and it is the basic basic property i'm using in the body tag and i'm giving the background color of ccc that is a gray color and i'm also giving it the text alignment of center and the text color of white okay so now for the heading h1 i'm giving the margin of zero pixel and now for the id of wrapper i am giving the width of 500 pixels and also giving the border of one pixel solid and of x color called 333 you cannot see the border because it's of one pixel and here i'm giving the position of relative for animation purposes now i want to center our animation so i am giving the margin top margin left 
of 450 pixels and margin right of 300 pixels. I have written this for center down our animation. Okay. So now for the ID wrapper and it tag H1. I am giving it the padding of 50 pixels. This will be the height of our box. You can see height of the box. Okay. So now for the ID content, I am giving the color of 000, that is the black color and it is the text color and I'm going to give it the background color of white that is FFF okay now for the I did call top I have to given the overflow hidden and the background color of I'm giving a hex color that is one F1 to to see it is a shade of blue color and I'm also giving the width of 100% and giving the height of 90% you will understand this when we make our animation in the last I will tell you why we have taken this height 90% and position absolute for the animation purposes and top to zero pixel and left to zero pixels okay you can see now okay i have set this top and left to zero pixels because we want to over overwrite our main content okay we want this top to be to place over our main content so we have taken this now i'm giving the transition property and the transition is for height and it will last for five seconds you can say five seconds or two seconds and the drop another property is is, is the timing function now when I hover over the wrapper, we want our top to be changed. So here I am writing top and we want our top's height to be 0% when we hover over the wrapper ID. Okay, so we have to write this kind of code. So now I'm going to save it and I'm going to open it in the browser. And you can see when I hover over it, it is going to height of 0 pixels 0% 0 or 0 pixels and when I take back my cursor it is moving to its original position of 90% here I have taken this 90% because some person who don't know this kind of animation in our, our website suppose we have put this kind of animation in our website and many persons are unaware of it so if they see this kind of uh, height they can they may have a hold it okay so we have taken this height of 90 percent and i have also taken the content of uh, this hey guys same because uh, we don't want other kind of contents okay to be revealed so that's it for this video and if you guys enjoyed my video then please subscribe and like this video and if you guys have any doubts about this video you can comment in the below section okay thank you guys for watching this video